are you surprised in any way or, or maybe not surprised, but how does it feel, I guess, for you to see, you know, what you guys have done being, you know, re- respected and, and continued for so, so long by all these brands and all these people? It's amazing. I mean, it really is amazing, you know, that because the hints of it were there when we very first started, we appealed to everybody. We would yeah. see families always come, you know, with their kids and the, the father and the mother, they were involved. They like it. They watched the movies together. They took cross country trips together, listening to our tapes and blah, 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 you know, but it was always a family. That's what we used to say is, is we, we make the only true a uh, uh, family movies because you have to take your family in order to get in to see it. <laughs> that's true. Yeah, <laughs> you know, at a certain age, you're, that's the only way you're getting in. Yeah, oh, exactly. So, so we always go, and 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 it is amazing. We have a certain feel to our work that really appeals to everybody at the same work at the same time, young and old, and they both yeah. kind of get the joke, you know. So I'm lucky that way, I guess. No question. I mean, when you first teamed up with Tommy Chong, I mean, how long exactly did it take? Like, did you guys start doing comedy that wasn't Cheech and Chong at first? And how long did it take to form? You did, right? Yeah. Yeah. I met Tommy in Vancouver. And he was always a musician all his life, was with Motown for many years. He had a band, was the first mixed band ever signed to Motown. He wrote a big hit for it, Does Your Mama Know About Me? Mm, And uh, and, uh, and all those things. So we were, and I was a musician all my life too, since I was a little kid. And and so when I first met him, he was, he had seen improv theater on in his days on the road in Chicago, the Second City, and San Francisco, mm-hmm. the committee, and other groups. And so when he finished with his deal with Motown, he decided, decided that's what he wanted to do. He wanted to do improv theater. Never had spoken on stage before. I mean, he was wow. a guitar player. Ambitious. <laughs> yeah, but that's what he wanted to do. So when he got back to Vancouver after uh, his, his his parents had been entrusted to his, he left them with this nightclub to run in his in his absence, and they had turned it into Vancouver's first topless bar. You know, oh, wow. so, there you and go. it was it was in Chinatown in Vancouver, real rough section, rough yeah. section, still uh, really, today, right? Still, to, oh yeah, it's a, it's probably even rougher too. Yeah, well, well you know, Vancouver has a a, a a reputation for a lot of things. It was it was, it, it was always a, a Chinese port. Canada always had a relationship with Red China during the days, yeah. so it was the big heroin ent- entree mm-hmm. in Vancouver. So you know, Vancouver was known for that. You know, and so it was it was a tough neighborhood. And uh, and so he's running this, 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 he decided to turn the topless bar into an improv theater, but still keep the topless element. So <laughs> oh, there top- you go. Improv, you know, in, in effect, what we were doing is I kind of realized later what we were doing was hippie burlesque. It was classic right. burlesque, comedians and strippers. That's it, interesting, that's- though. That is exactly the recipe of of, of burlesque. You know, Lenny right. Bruce came out of that. A lot of other uh, things, guys came out of that. But that's what we were doing. But it was the but the comedy element was improv comedy that we right. started to do with the strippers. And so Tommy came to the dancers and he said, "Okay, girls, you're not you're not strippers anymore. Oh, no, 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 you're <laughs> actresses. Oh, okay. So you get paid less. But you're <laughs> oh yeah, you're exactly. Yeah, we got to adjust clothes. the pay grade too." <laughs> <laughs> so you can't afford clothes, so we, we'll do it without the clothes. <laughs> yeah, costume but, department's yeah. cheaper. It is. <laughs> <laughs> you can get a G string, man. That's it. <laughs> and so is so we we had this weird hybrid of of you know down home uh, 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 strip bar and this improv comedy to do this at the same time, and so we started attracting an audience. Of course, you know. Yeah, because it, because it was a tough audience at first. It was loggers and bikers, right. and, and and it was a tough crowd. You know, they, they, the only thing we were afraid of is because they always try to get up this on the stage and beat us up. You know, because, really? Yeah, because hey, you know, I'm supposed to be naked girls. What are you guys doing? <laughs> yeah, who's these guys talking to us? You know what the <laughs> fuck? You know, 
And, and so they sometimes get pissed off. And all of a sudden, because bikers aren't the easiest ones to make laugh. Yeah, that's yeah, that's <laughs> so, true. Not a notorious a really reputation for that. Sense of humor. <laughs> <laughs> and so all of a sudden we started doing that. And then all of a sudden for, we got reviewed by the by the Vancouver Sun, the big newspaper. Mm-hmm. And he, and he didn't much like us, but he appreciated what we were trying to do. So then right. we started drawing on audience, and then boom, boom, boom. And then, uh, the, uh, of course, at the certain point, um, the, the the rest of the group quit to go to the hills and get their head together, I guess. And mm. I went into the hills. Uh, my head was together. My pocketbook right. was together. So <laughs> it was just me and Tommy, and we decided, decided well, what do we do? Well, we'll have a duo, but you're you're a singer and I'm a guitar player. We'll have a band and we'll be like a lounge act, you know. We could mm. maybe play Vegas or something like that. 